This is the legendary poor fruit in Blocks Fruits, which is a fruit I only have 11 mastery total in. So today we're going to be leveling this fruit all the way to max to see if it's actually a good legendary fruit. To make this more difficult for myself, I can only get kills from the maximum possible distance when using the poor Z and X moves and possibly some of the other ones. The only reason why this challenge is possible is because the poor fruit is special. And honestly, that's in a bad way because I'm going to be suffering this video. This move here, heavy paw, apparently has infinite range or near infinite range. So if I aim at stone and I fire this off, I hit the floor. Hang on, let me stand on this tree so I've got some verticality. I'm like a sniper rifle. Heavy paw. That should go infinite distance. And did I miss? I should go through his legs. One more try. Yep, there we go. We can hit stone. I was like from very close though. So we're actually going to be firing it from like this far away every single time. So I've got to hope that that hits. And it did. And I have to somehow kill every single boss from this range. This is going to be pain. He's going to keep on running towards me. So I have to always hit him when he's at the furthest point away. But this is going to be so difficult. He's only taken that much damage. And this is the weakest boss in the third C. As soon as I get Paul Barrage, this will be like a bit easier. But for now, it's literally just pressing Z over and over and over. I also got to be careful because anybody in this lobby could come and try and yoink the stone kill. All right, please respawn. I know you're gonna respawn. Yep, I knew it. Boom. What? Did that not hit? I have my hacky on, right? Yep, there we go. It's on. Bonk. This seems really like finicky and buggy. So <laughs> this is gonna be so difficult to do. I think I could probably get away with this tree. Pew. Yes, I can. I got a headshot. Another one. Yes. He's getting low. There's a furry attacking him. Bro, my plan is ruined. As long as I can get my damage, I'm not complaining. Furry, get out of the way. Can you not see I'm trying to snipe him here? Oh, he's actually out of the way. No, right, fine. We got moving target practice this time now. I can't even see stone. Where is stone god? I hit that guy instead. <laughs> oh, stone's coming for me. Nice. Phew. He's getting low. Well, that guy's also kind of getting low. I need to show him what happens when he tries to steal my kill. Here goes. I'm going first person. We're going sniper mode. Pew. Uh-oh. Oh, he's saying hi. Okay, I'm chilling. Where's stone gone? Oh, there he is. Okay, stone still exists. That's good. I'm kind of happy this guy. I came over to help, but that takes away the point of this being a challenge. So what do you say? Can I test something? Bro, test it on somebody else. You don't want me to destroy you with a heavy paw. No, 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 no. I need to get the last hit. I need to get the last hit. We're doing it from the top of the mountain. Pew! The snipe! The snipe! I actually got the snipe! Yoink! Now I make my escape. I hope that gives me 100 levels, please. Yep! We got paw barrage. Perfect. Now I can snipe this guy. He caused problems. Where does he think he's going? Pew! He's gonna go all the way over there and get hit. 100%. Never mind. This guy's just like grinding or something. Maybe I test out my new move. Pour barrage on his skull. Take this. I joined the kill. I'm done. I got a new move called self repel. What's this do? The heck did that even do? This do damage? Nice. The island empress is also here. So the best place to attack the island empress is obviously going to be at the very top up here. This self repel move is terrible and it doesn't have long range. So it's kind of useless. Is that guy trying to attack the island empress? I can't even see the island empress. I went too high. What about from here? Okay, this tree works. No, 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 no. Buddha fruit guy, stop. You're ruining my thing. Okay, fine. Poor barrage from the sky. We're taking that guy down. He's probably like, where did that come from? <laughs> He's running away. Uh-oh. He definitely sees me. No. I made a big mistake, especially when I don't even know what my F button does. Take this. Oh, he died. Okay, cool. Right. Now I can continue my long range snipes. Back up into the tree I go. This guy's really persistent. What is he doing? Pew. I'm just going to keep sniping him. It would be nice if self repel actually like did something. Also, I don't think I'm going to get any kill credit for this boss. If I break this guy's observation, then he might die. This is my genius strategy. Oh, wait, did he die to get out of combat? No, that's cringe. Okay, I need a new tree. He's on that tree over there. Maybe from up here. Take this island, Empress. Nice, nice. Big damage. 4,000. I think we can go higher though. Yep, here will be perfect. Will this actually work? Yeah, it does. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Wait, is she dead? Oh, no, she's alive. Bro, you can't be baiting me like that. You're, you're making me have to go out of my spot. Bro, is she dead? You're really out here causing problems. Maybe Captain Elephant's available to get sniped. I doubt he will be, though. Yep, he is gone as well. I need to find an uncontested boss. Maybe the Kilo Admiral will be good. I don't know where I'll be able to snipe her from, though. The Kilo Admiral might just work, but this is, like, the furthest distance I can get away from her. There's nowhere else for me to stand. It's impossible otherwise. But you can just, like, walk over here. Oh, wait, maybe we're in business, actually. Can I go over to this island? This might work. As long as she appears, like, over there. Is she gonna peek? Nope. All right, note to self, that from all the way over there does not work. What if I jump in the sky and like go really far away? That might work. Or barrage, huge. All right, now respawn, Kilo Admiral. Perfect. This will have to do. One thing I do want to test, actually, is the self-repel do damage? Bonk. That does not- Oh, wow. I'm nearly dead. With the force at which you use that move, I thought for sure it would do damage, but nope, it doesn't. All right, Kilo Admiral, I'll be back later when I've got close range moves. Oh, nice. Captain Elephant's back. Okay. This is like the hardest shot to hit because he's like behind a tree, but maybe I can hit that. I feel like those are just like going through him. Activate Hacky just in case. What? I'm convinced that hit him in the skull. Is there like a limited range that you can hit NPCs from? This don't make sense. How much closer do I need to get? Like what's the limit? Or is he just bugged? Yo, Captain Elephant, wake up. 
Oh, they're awake. Oh, no. Boom. Oh, now it's working. And he can't get up that bit of grass. Oh, this is perfect. As long as I don't make an explosion, I should be fine. I made an explosion. Oh, no. Poor snipe. I think this will actually work. Oh, no. They're stuck on the tree. Oh, no. They're good. Can I still damage them? Yeah, this is actually gonna work. They've lost like a smidge of health so far. They call me the sniper. 7.5k damage every time. Not bad. You see, if you're ever too weak to defeat a mob in the third C, this is the ultimate strategy to be able to do it. After all, they can't hurt you if they can't even get close. He's below half. I'm actually doing it. Keep on firing my machine gun and my sniper rifle shots. They'll be gone in no time so low. He's actually like basically on like a smidge. A few more shots and he's done. When he gets low enough, I'm gonna try and go as far away as possible. Can I go further than this? Like over here? Surely it works. Yep, it hits from there. So can I go further? Okay, I think I can hit from there. Yep, we're going even further. All the way up here. Oh, I think that's too Is that too far? Where's Captain Elephant gone? Oh, they're there. Can I hit from here? What? I'm being scammed. She's like one shot, but it's not registering. Are you? No! Bruh! I tried to re-aggro her and I hit her with the- Ah. All of that just to get three god human mastery. Blogsroos is messed up. They're evil for that. I mean, it was totally not my fault at all. You know, maybe until we get poor nuke, <laughs> which sounds amazing, we should probably try and fight some like minions from far away instead. So like this giant islander down here, maybe if I go, can I go to the top of this like pride rock looking thing and then be chilling? I don't think so. What's the highest I can be? Like here? Okay, I've got an idea. We're going all the way over here. This tree will be our perch. Now I just need to find like an enemy that's very far away. Oh, two targets spotted. Okay, we'll go for that one first. How did I hit the tree? Go for that one instead. That was definitely a hit. They despawned? This is impossible. Wait, but this one's fallen down here. What is wrong with that one? What? How am I meant to hit that? Bro, it's actually kind of scary. It's like a shark. Oh, God. No, no, no. Get away. We're sniping that thing. I'm not letting it get close. How am I meant to hit that? Oh, no. Where is it gone? I think it's disappeared. Okay, we're in the clear. This is dude perfect. And today we're doing the through the bamboo skull shot. Are you ready? Let's go. That's like perfectly aligned. <laughs> I actually hit. Did it do damage? I don't get this. How do I make it do more damage? Wait, wait, wait. She's angry at me now. How about now? No, I hit the bamboo. My through the bamboo shot didn't work. Okay, here we go. Attempt two. The through the bamboo shot will be a success. Wait, respawn, respawn. There we go. Perfect. Through the bamboo. Yes. We got three whole mastery. Bosses might take the longest, but they're definitely going to be the best way to do this. Oh, that was like when people shoot the discs out of the sky, but in blocks roots. <laughs> I think this is as good as I'm going to get with the Island Empress. If she's all the way down there, she keeps running towards me. Maybe I can like, I think this works. Am I even damaging her? I can't tell. Okay, it's kind of working. What if I go from here? This is so stressful. Oh yeah, this works. Nice. Now we grind. She's literally like one shot. Once she's at the furthest distance, she's finished. Why are you like peeking around the corner like a doors monster? All right, there we go. Boom. She's done. Surely. What? She just tanked it. Oh, how about now? Yes. Oh, I actually did it. And we only got to mastery 151. I need poor nuke badly so I can do close range attacks. I don't want to have to be cursed to be a sniper rifle this entire time. You know what? We're doing something incredibly risky. We're trying Cake Queen. I think this is literally as far as I'm going to get for Cake Queen. She's stuck on the other side of the wall. This is going to work. You can see the little sword sticking out the wall if I shoot there. It does damage. And that's only because this fruit has like explosion damage. Yes, it might take me 20 minutes, but I will do this. 20 minutes might be an understatement at this level. I can barely defeat Cake Queen normally. Wait, this might actually work really well. So it's been about 15 minutes and you're probably wondering, you know, how low is the Cake Queen? Ignore my health. She totally didn't snipe for me one time. She's a half and this has been 15 minutes. This is messed up. She's not even, wait, did I take too long to attack? She's not even taking damage now. No, 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 no. Are we in the clear? Oh, we're in the clear. Woo. I thought my hard work and effort was in vain. Ow. I don't know why, but for some reason she can like do that now. But I'm not worried. Another 15 minutes and we should be good. All of this for me to get like 20 mastery at the end of it. That's what's gonna happen. I can see it from a mile away. Roll on update 20 when we don't have to do this to get mastery anymore. Uh, another 10 minutes later and she's getting so close. I can smell the fit. I can taste the finish line. Just keep on barraging. That's all that I know. How is she alive? She's got negative one health. She doesn't even have a health bar. Please give me poor nuke. Give me the nuke. Show it to me. Please. 190. Ah, no! We need one more boss, and then I think we can get nuke. And then we can grind like a regular human being. This is it. All this suffering. Stone, you're the final one. I'm gonna rain down an airstrike. Here we go. Airstrike! Yes! We got poor nuke! Oh, I'm so excited to use this. Oh, that looks sick. And it's... Wait, it better not be long range. Hang on. That looked like it could have gone pretty far. And it's kind of crazy. Poor Nuke is 200 mastery. But the one after this sounds even cool. It's just called torture. I mean, this challenge has been exactly that. So, all right, K-Queen, follow me. Poor Nuke. Please don't be long range. Please don't be long range. Please don't be long range. It's long range. Okay, right. I guess we're going to sit here and we're going to farm the Cake queen then. This is how it'll go. She'll poke out there. Let me hit it with a barrage. Hit it with one of these. And then we throw a nuke. <laughs> 
Oh, wait, that's cool. It fires like the tiniest little paw you've ever seen, and it's just a giant nuke blast. The good news is it's going to take way less time than it did previously because we've just got a brand new move. Well, one final combo, and this should be it. Yep. All right, this is going to be massive. 226. Not as massive as I thought it would be. And that's mastery 250. Only 50 more mastery to go. Then we get the final move. Yes, mastery 300. New skill available. My final move called torture. And it only makes sense that I used it on a boss that has literally tortured me this entire time. So I'm going to take down Kate Queen using torture. I have no idea what this move does, so I hope it does a lot of damage. Torture? Nothing's happening. I'm just like stood here. In fact, I'm looking at the floor. I'm floating. Torture. Oh, and then it does like passive damage as well. Okay. Oh, it's not stopping. Wait, so what happens because she's got this little paw on her? Is that like how it combos? You use heavy paw, get the paw on her, and then you use torture and does like more damage maybe? It also works with that one. What about paw nuke? Does paw nuke make the paw effect? Bonk. No, it does not. Okay. I need to hit her with a paw attack. Perfect. And now we torture. Feel the pain. Feel the pain. Is it doing more damage? I can't tell. It's not bad damage, though. 13k? Poor nuke is definitely the cooler move out of all of these, though. Now we just got to test. Does torture go infinite distances? Boom! It's going. It's traveling. Oh, it hits! So every single move has, like, insane distance in the attacks. Really? Well, isn't that fantastic? So I've just got to stay here and defeat her from all the way down here. But at least I can use every single move now. <laughs> this is messed up, like I was saying. What I'm having to do right now is exactly what the V move is. Boom. How far does it go? Oh, wow. That actually does go really far. And she's getting low. Can I go from like this far away? Does it work? Oh, it actually does. What? So can I hit her from like here? Yep. All right. What about all the way over here? Is it going to work? Will it even reach? It does. We got to finish her with a nuke. What? She's not dead. I got to inspect. Wow. How did you survive that? Okay, fine. This is it. For all of my suffering, I'm sending it all back. Boom. Yes. I have fully mastered the paw fruit. All that it took was an immense amount of pain and suffering. As you could tell, like my final move there, it did a lot of damage. But if you want to see the journey it took me to fully master the barrier fruit, then check out this video on screen.